Hey, how are you going? Ah, let me try that again. How are you guys doing? I am not on my game today. Which is why I didn't really want to start anything new. Uh, the name of this song, I said last time, it's a song called Long Man by a guy named James Walmack. If you go to any of the videos on After Hours, you can, uh, find a link to the page for uh, a download. It's good stuff. I've got some tea boiling in the background. It's probably going to go off any second knowing my fucking luck. But let's go and do some uh, Fallout. How does that sound? I don't know what the deal is. I think I've just got like a little bit of a summer cold or something. Oops, Skype's still unavailable. I should turn myself on Do Not Disturb. Uh, Yol at some point said he wants to do Blind Mario, but um, I don't know if that's going to be a thing or not. We were going to do it yesterday, but then stuff happened. Stuff got in the way, as is life. Um, so, we didn't. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is with me right now, but I am just not, not at a thousand percent, you know? Maybe I should just rest, but I don't know. I really feel like streaming. Well, thank you, dog. I'm gonna call you dog, because that's something that companions call each other, and also because your last name, or your name has dog in it, and that's the T. Hold on. Made some rad bomber tea. It makes me feel better whenever I'm feeling a little bit sick. Um, just a little bit sniffly. So we're just gonna try and uh, make sure that I'm doing the best I can. Uh, rad bomber tea is a green tea with um, berries and stuff like that. It's a special type of green tea called gunpowder. And holy fuck balls, that's loud. Hold on. Um, Yeah, I don't- I don't drink when I'm feeling sick. I just try not to do anything. Hey, guys. There is no song list, I'm sorry. It's- it's literally just the game. Ginger tea is good. Um, I'm gonna try and make another tea on Adagio. Uh, lemongrass and lavender is probably pretty bad. Alright, I gotta, um, do things. Oh god, we got this horrible looking pit boy the other day. Or yesterday, last night. So, um, because chat really wanted me to get it, so I went and got it, and it took us all of about two hours to do it, and then, yeah. So, uh, Brotherhood of Steel, great cons or boomers. By the way, I'm gonna have to walk out this door, I'll let you guys decide where I'm going. What do I recommend to someone who, uh, I mean, I've got teas that I sell, um, so. Those I recommend. The one I like is the uh, Rev T. Um, it has a, a gold and black label. Um, it's it's good. It's um it's like a darker, earthy kind of tea with uh, a chocolate taste. Where the fuck is Veronica? God, that thing is so ostentatious. Um. So I mean. I don't know, start with something simple maybe, like, uh, Irish breakfast, and maybe like a green tea or something, I don't know. Alright, um... Only vote is for boomers. Well, there was a couple votes, but that's the only one I'm paying attention to, because that's what I feel like doing. So, uh, Veronica is right nearby. Veronica, where are you at? Tell me she's not just waiting somewhere, right? Let's move my marker to Veronica. She in here? Veronica, you in here? Yeah, breakfast tea. That's what we call it. Don't know why. There's a nice little place here in Austin, and if you're uh if you've ever or if you ever go to Austin, I highly recommend it. It's called Full English. It's a little um breakfast place local 
um, owned by a British woman who who serves strictly British food or drink Brit yeah, British um, style breakfast, which is good. The only problem with the place is it never is fucking open. Like it's never Aww. open. Just when the standing around was getting. Okay, come with me. So. I like it, but we can never fucking find out when it's open. Because they- it's just a local business. They basically are open when they feel like it. Which is not the best schedule, in my opinion. But the food is so good that I still recommend it. So there's Red Rock Can Canyon, and there's Hidden Valley. Canyon- yeah. I can- I just keep tripping over my words. All right, local, world map. All right, all right. So this has to be the boomers over here. All right, just figure out where we need to go. There's the boomers. I know it's fucking hideous. I agree, but I think I need to go this way. Yeah, sure, whatever. I hate. I hate summer in Texas. We get pretty decent seasons otherwise, but oh my god. Fucking summer here is awful. Uh, triple digit temperatures for Fahrenheit users. And um, for those of you that don't use Fahrenheit, it's in like the upper 30s for Celsius. Like bare minimum 35. So it's just fucking awful. There's there's no fast travel to this place, is there? It's just I'm gonna have to fucking walk there. All right, fine. You can ask him to change back to the old one. No, chat wants this ostentatious piece of shit, so that's what we're gonna go with. Winter is nice um, in Texas because it's rarely actually cold. What we call cold is like 70, which is like a decent ways away from oh yeah I killed that child last time uh, it's a decent ways away from freezing when it freezes it's like hell like I remember last time it froze over the um, I think it was um, the police chief actually put out a warning saying you know unless if you're essential personnel like do not go outside because we build all our roads up in the air on like huge platforms, several stories tall, you know? And um, that means that shit happens. Like it all freezes over. And if, you know, you're driving on something that's like up in the air, it, uh, it freezes almost instantaneously, which means that everyone's gonna be sliding around and then sliding down. the hill. Now, that excludes places like El Paso that actually gets snow pretty much every season, and some of the northern parts of Texas, but here in Austin, you know, central Texas, it's, um, it's a completely different thing. I think I got a mod that's somewhere in this area, but I forget exactly where. Um, but we're gonna go see the boomers. I think they hate me. I'm pretty sure I killed some of them. I'm pretty sure they hate me. So it's generally speaking this direction. I put a, a waypoint down next to it, so that way I can tell which one it is. Like, if it actually freezes here, it's just hell. Um, snow we generally enjoy, but it does stop all work. So, I should probably have my gun out, because I have a feeling that shit's gonna go down as soon as I find the boomers. But I have to go and find them and talk to them for the sake of Yes Man being happy. I don't really know why I can't just tell Yes Man that I fucking hate all of them. Um, like, he's basically going, do you want to team up or do you like any of these guys? Whoa. Whoa. What's attacking? Veronica, what's going on? I hear the combat music, but I don't fucking see anything. Get my back up against the wall. What the 
fuck is attacking me? Is it the Brahmin over there? Is the Brahmin attacking? The combat music has stopped. Oh, no, it started again. Is it this... The only thing I see here is the Brahmin, and I'm pretty sure they're not attacking. Is it up on the ridge, whatever's attacking me? No, that Brahmin is actually coming after me. Why the fuck was the bull attacking me? Alright, well that happened. It takes about 10 bullets to take down stronger enemies. I don't know if he's, uh... Yeah, I have to meet them, though. He's like, do you think any of these are worthy of being, like, rivals or being, you know, near you? And I'm just like, no. Categorically, anyone who thinks they're as good as me is not. What is this? Ammunition box. Oh, perfect for the ammo that I use. Field shack. Let's go into the field shack. I'm not Fred, but, you know, good guess. I don't know what kind of round that is, but we'll go and take it. Yeah, we should probably get more uh, points into gun. Just that way I don't suck at shooting things. Um, I should also finish... Missile? Damn. Are they heavy? They're probably heavy. I like that this place is just ammo. It's cool. I also like that I'm off the strip. Because the main problem with being on the strip is you don't get to use your guns. Like, everyone just takes your guns all the fucking time. Like, they have any right or purpose in doing so. Like, it's just like, let me have my gun. You guys know I'm just gonna shoot up the fucking place. So you're just putting a barrier between me doing that. Like, I just, I'm gonna kill everyone. Just straight up gonna happen. And you're just slowing me down. And that just means you're first. As soon as I get a gun, you're first to die. But no, we gotta do the stupid side quest, because that's what Yes Man wants. We can't just fucking beeline through this game. Whoa there, pal. You better slow down, or you'll get blown up like the rest of the idiots who thought they'd scavenge in Boomer territory. Okay. Now that I've got your attention, might you be interested in a little information? It'll cost you, but it's well worth the investment. Uh, yeah. Whoa, simmer down. I'll tell you. I'm a gambler and a scavenger. Uh -huh. I've made some cash from gambling and some cash from reclaiming goods. Yeah, okay. Oh, lordy lordy. You haven't heard of the boomers? I've heard of them. What I've shot them. What have you been living under? No, I shot them. They're dead. They're a bunch of artillery slinging, grenade lobbing odd jobs camping out in Nellis. Wander into their territory and you're as good as mincemeat. Um, is there a way to get past? There is a way. Uh, wager. Well, I know the secret to get past. If you give me the caps, I'll tell you. If that's you make not... it back alive, I'll double your money. I was gonna say, that's not really a, a wager. Okay, fine. Suit yourself. Come back and see me when you get tired of picking shrapnel out of your back. Wait, didn't I say yes? Wait, do I just not have the money to do it? Is that the problem? Oh, yeah, I just don't have the money to do it. Okay. Well. Alright. I'm gonna save. Then we're gonna try and do this. Everyone's telling me. Be careful. Okay. Once I get past these signs, we're gonna start having problems, apparently. Now, I assume I can't just walk there. Um, like, it's not just gonna let me just go. So let's put on some, maybe, armor. Um, I don't think I've got any armor. Oh shit! Fuck! 
Okay, didn't realize there was gonna be artillery. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's heal up a bit. I, I clearly was not aware of what was going to happen here. Oh! And I'm dead. <sighs> okay. Can I threaten him? Welcome back. Have you? Yeah. So just. <sighs> Veronica, you got some caps I can spare? All right. Um. I don't know if hiding helps or not. Please don't scream, it's gonna scare your neighbors. Okay, they can still hit me here. I'm stuck in the rock. I can't move. Oh, dead. Oh my god, my leg came off. That's not good. Throw the coke I was drinking away. Hiding does not help, apparently. I thought it was gonna be like mines and stuff, so I was like... Hiding. But no, it's... 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 fucking mortars. Did I do it? Okay. I did okay. I'm just gonna stay up against the fence. They don't seem to want to shoot here. Hold it right there. Don't you move. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? I didn't the first two times. Um... I'm not telling you... Move a muscle now and I'll blow you to pieces. You're gonna shoot the fucking fence. Then just... Just stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. Okay. I'll take this from here. I'm Raquel, Master at Arms for uh -huh. the Nellis Homeland. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wishes to speak to you. Sure. Who's that? As I said, she is our eldest. Mother Pearl has lived at Nellis from the start, and has the wisdom of her age. She said that this day would come, and that any savage to reach our gate should be brought to her. I'm not a savage. Follow close. You're savage. You're the one that was fucking shooting me. Welcome, child. Took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? What the fuck? I've been waiting a good five years for an outsider to come along and visit. Okay. Prophecy. Do we look like a bunch of religious idiots? I don't fucking know. I just hoped a savage, uh, outsider, sorry, would make it to our gates before one of those armies out there comes knocking. I am an army. That's right, child. Mother Pearl knows a storm is gathering. Times are changing. Maybe time for us to change a little, too. Oh, so many ways. Small ones to begin with, so we can get used to what it's like to have a sav uh, outsider around and about. Should that go well, it may be you can help in big ways, too. We'll have to see. You have to keep in mind that you're our first contact with the outside world since I was barely a woman. Wait, what? Seclusion has kept us safe, but the world around us is changing. 
neon lights in the distance. Uh huh. My youngers think our guns can keep out the world, but I think we need to let it in just a little, or become its victim. Uh huh. You're that little bit of the world, child. Welcome to Nellis. You didn't really let me in. You picked a good time to stop by, for we're swimming in problems. Uh huh. My youngers can tell you all about it. Raquel could use help with the bug problem. Doc Argyle has wounded he's tending to. And Loyal and Jack might be looking for help with oh my some God. repairs. I'm not or good at any of that. you could just go see Pete at the museum and hear the story of our people. All you have to do oh, yeah, I want to go to a listen. fucking museum. Come and go as you like, help or don't help, I leave it up to you. But I hope you'll... Right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna steal some of their power armor because it's fucking boss. First, we're gonna steal this shit. I've lost karma. Pity me. Biker goggles. Uh, yeah, all that sucks. Well, Boomers was next on our list. Okay, there's Pearl. Is that Boomer gone? There we go. <sighs> I have to kill one of them. That's the idea, yeah. Morning. Morning. Raquel? Mother Pearl's instructions are clear. You can move freely around Nellis and artillery. Uh -huh. These are extraordinary privilege. Long story short, the power failed a few days ago because giant ants have tunneled into the generator room and set up a nest. I led a team down to exterminate them, but there were so many of them. We lost. Two killed, three wounded. Uh -huh. Personally, I think it's more than a savage can handle. But if you want to kill those ants... Okay. I can handle a few ants. Sure, anyone can. But, but one other thing. The ants must be eating gunpowder from the munitions down there. Or something. They exploded when hit by a flamethrower. One of us was using a laser pistol. Same thing. Bullets seem okay. Just don't hit the artillery shells. Loyal's gotcha. Been working on Shoot some the kind artillery of weapon shells. To use against them. Maybe you should check with him. Okay, I'll go find whoever Loyal is. Are you loyal? No. So is this like the remnants of a vault? Because they're all wearing like vault shirts. Where the fuck am I? Vault 34 specifically. Okay. See, that's what I'm asking. What's up, dude? Another glorious day in this man's army. Uh-huh. All of them have like explosives of some sort or another. Oh, that's not good odds. That doesn't do much. I need a better gun. Do I have like an explosive? That's not gonna be very silent. Explosive generally aren't. Um, these are all gonna be way too loud.
Golden Gloves. Inflicts fatigue damage. I look fucking fabulous. Grenade rifle. Okay. I'll take one of those. I know they don't do all that much damage, but here. Veronica, come over here. Um open inventory. You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Yeah, I'm gonna make you carry all the shit I don't want to carry because I'm not using it. Um you can have a uh, ballistic fist. You can have um I think I got some Yeah, you can have all of these really heavy things. Uh, the flamer fuel as well. Uh, the flower, because I don't need it. Um, you have the formal wear? Because I'm not wearing that anymore. Um, you can have this hammer. Um, okay, good. Oh, and you can have the wrench. Sexy sleepwear is what I'm wearing right hey, now. A dress. Thank you. I am totally trying this on later. How about like now? Like, I got you a dress. Fucking wear it. What is my weight limit at? Um, still a little bit overweight. I don't have the training. Uh, okay, Veronica. Fucking. You may carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Yeah, I am. But you know, fucking deal. Do you want this power armor? I'd rather see you in a dress, because I think that would be funnier. And honestly, you seem to do alright without it. Um, so I don't have the trainer to do it. Um, or the training to do it. I'm worried that she's gonna try and wear some of this shit if I give it to her. And I really don't want her to. I want her to wear the dress, because that's fucking hilarious. Um, because it's just like, she's way too badass to just be wearing like, you know, a little sundress or whatever, you know? Not that you can't be badass with a sundress on, but you know what I mean. Power armor's pretty much as badass as this game goes. Um, hey, thank you, Fonzies. I don't know what of this that I want to get rid of, though. Well, I don't care if you can wear it or not. <sighs> okay, fine. The armor will stay here. We know where we can get some. I think it's four. Yeah, there we go. Um... It'd probably be good to get a few points into a uh, pistol, just because I don't have any. Um, and this uses five mil? Okay, I don't know how that works out, but there we go. All right. What about the sledgehammer? Oh yeah. Hey, Veronica. Veronica? Oh hey, Veronica. Um, You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? No, it's just a sledgehammer. They're not known for being heavy. Uh, wait, no, I don't have that, so you're good. You get a free set when you get done with the training. Uh, Alright, we're gonna do one quest for these guys, just so that way I feel justified for killing them. I mean, they really have already started shooting at me, so I could just sneak in and shoot Pearl and be done with it. I'm gonna go to whatever this is over here. So I think this is... is this for the quest that I'm in? 
quest. Ants. This way. The assault carbine apparently isn't all that great. Okay. Getting close to it now. Whatever it is that I'm supposed to be going into. It's right here. Okay, good. That gun is, uh, vanilla. Hey, loyal. I hope Pearl knows what she's doing. God, your face is fucked. Uh, yeah. I started building a sonic emitter that might do the trick, but it's useless without knowing the. Yeah, you sound like you're bullshitting me. Hot damn, you're right. It's a matter of boosting across those thresholds, not exact amplitude. You're smarter than you look. Yeah, I'm just, just wearing so happens, I was testing it at 24,000 hertz, so it should be good to go. Place it near their nest and cross your fingers. Signal's too high for people to hear, so no harm done. But it might make you feel sick to your stomach. Okay. Sonic sound emitter. Is it just... A thing I have? Don't see it. Okay. Uh, that gun is just a good early game weapon. So I gotta remember to try and not shoot their explosive stash, or else I will get killed. It's a quest item. Okay, so it's not in my inventory, as you would normally expect. Um... Where the fuck is this place? What? What? Wow, there are a lot of guys here. Watch your step, sister. Sister? I'm a dude. Okay. Oh, it's this way. I got confused. Why are we shooting at ants anyway? So just by having enough science, I'm going to be able to skip most of the fighting in this. So that's cool. Alright, um... Nothing in that barrel. Oh shit! Damn! Why did it explode? Okay, they're just exploding randomly now. Why is that? What's happening? Doesn't take a whole lot to just shoot them and they die. Suicide ants. That sounds fun. Are you alive? Boomers, so I can look like a fucking... No, I don't want to look like a, a school boy. Cub Scout, motherfucker. Okay. Okay, I don't see them. Don't fuck up the jump, Veronica. It's a long way down. Okay, this is the one I shot a minute ago. Should be another one in front of me or down below me. I don't see them. That I don't see them makes me nervous. Okay. Hey, Kicken. How you doing? Okay. I don't see anything down there. Which means that there's something down there. 
I know my fucking luck. I know how this shit works. Yup. Okay. I don't know how to turn R9K off. So, it's just gonna have to stay on until Reds comes by and turns it off. Probably should ask him to do that. Maybe it's, um, hold on. Um, I don't know how to turn R9 and K off. It's not slash R9 K. R9 K means that you can't post something that someone's already posted, but if it's around for a while, then it's just basically to prevent people from all spamming the chat with the same shit. Veronica, you got any idea what we're doing here? Place sound emitter on. Okay. Stop. So I imagine that they were down there. We just didn't see them because I wasn't making any sound. Okay, this looks like a thing. Oh fuck, what did I just do? I think I just did a bad thing. Is that what I was supposed to be doing? Is this, is this really the issue that we were dealing with? Three ants and a fucking ant mound? We couldn't have just waited until the guy came up with the thing? Okay. Hey, the lights are on. Well, that was easy. Faster reload is good. All right, got to go talk to Raquel now. Yup. Hate that they're always shooting explosives. There's literally nothing to shoot out out there. I'm the first person to make it past your defenses since ever. And we still got to be shooting randomly into the desert. I don't know how you have this much ammo. Like what what do you what are you shooting? Those Brahmin? The Brahmin are not that difficult. You don't need to use explosives. Is this a howitzer? Can I use the howitzer? I want to use the howitzer. They are my weird duck feet. Raquel! Your shit, it's done. Because I don't suck like all the people you sent in there to die. FOV is definitely lower than it should be, but you know. Hello. Hey. I see the power's back on. The ants are all dead. Yes. Maybe Pearl is right about you. Because I don't know how you pulled that off. I didn't suck. I'll tell Loyal to send someone down to clear out the eggs and repair the generators. Good work. Okay. Watch your step, sister. I don't know why people call keep calling me sister. Oh. Okay. Rev just disappeared from the team list. It's probably glitching out because I'm live. It does that sometimes, I've noticed. Alright, um, that was easy. Do I get anything for it? Voltaire. air. Oh, Alright, now I also need to do stuff with the NCR. Fuck. Wait, what is this? What am I doing? Where's the fucking museum? I kind of want to go see how lame this place is. Another glorious day in this man's army. Yes.
Are they mad at Veronica because she's Iron Brotherhood or whatever? Yeah, here's the museum. Cool. Wait, is are you? You're the outsider. Mother Pearl sent word that you'd be stopping by. Uh huh. Who are you? Me. I'm Pete, keeper of the story. So you're a child. I know that's I going seem to kind of young. I was the apprentice keeper of the story until a couple months ago, but old keeper, whiskey and landmines don't go together. So it's up to me. I bet you want to know everything about us. Um. Fuck. Damn it. Damn it. This child is invincible. Damn it. Damn it. Steel BBs? Sure. And he's even stowed away under the thing, so... Oh, hey, there's this, too. Anything else? Alright, good. Moving on, who else needs help? Let's just go help everyone, like we just helped him. I'll probably have to put on some boomer gear just so they don't get mad at me. Okay, one of them's in here. I don't know how anyone knows that I killed him, considering there was no witnesses other than the guy that died. Um, Jack. So you're the outsider. Uh-huh. I always thought you savages probably spoke a different language. Yeah, uh... Me? I work with Loyal. Mostly electro- Uh-huh. Loyal's a great man, but he's getting on in years. So a younger's gotta learn everything he knows. The man knows how to fix and build just about everything that was ever made. It's not- If you help him recover the lady, I figure- Oh, I figure it's been a nice day. Recover the lady? Did I say that? Sometimes I just say stupid things. Sorry about that. No. Pearl will tell you when the time comes. If... I mean... I should really be going. I need to go ask someone about the lady, because I have a feeling that's probably a fucking robot or something cool. If they have a fucking robot, we might be chill. I did kill one of their children, and he's like the only one who knows the history of their people. So, loyal. What is it, outsider? Um... If that's so, how about you look into repairing the solar arrays on the roof of the generator building? Uh-huh. Nothing too complicated about it, but it's a long ways to walk my old bones. Okay. You can't miss the array. It's uh -huh. on top of... Huh. If we had spare parts, do you think I'd be asking you to fix the damn thing? Mm hmm No, we ran out of spares a while back. And Jack and I have been doing our best to patch the arrays up as best we can. Uh huh. Sadly, there have to be spare parts somewhere around the wasteland, but I just don't know where to direct you. <sighs> you this quest sounds like it sucks. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking, Ego. Like the one caravan guard from Prim. He kind of looks exactly like him. Uh, let's talk about something else. I want to. No, those aren't for. Oh. Well, if you genuinely care so much, they're flight simulators. If you don't know our history yet, you should see Pete and get the tour. Oh shit. We dream to one day rule the skies. See ya. Well, I guess I better go talk to Pete about the history of you people. Considering he's still alive. And not dead. Um, should I reload before I killed Pete? Because I thought it was just going to be a lot of boring plot points, but if I get to be in a plane because of it, I might be slightly interested. Um, 
If I can use the resurrect thing. Let's see when the most recent save was. It's about 13 minutes ago. Um... You don't get to fly a plane. Do I get to use the pods? Can I pretend to fly in a video game? Hello. Damn it! Damn it! Fucking bullshit! Veronica got in the way! Now I can't aim for shit because my arms are broken. Well. I'm already dead, you don't need to shoot me again. My aim got worse. Think it broke. Because I've got too many saves. Good. I have too many saves, so I can't... Um... Yeah, it's crashed. Okay, let's go ahead and... Um... Ooh, okay. We actually have crashed the start manager as well. Um, that's interesting. How do I uh, check different tabs? Damn it. The problem is that I don't have mouse control. And I can't get mouse control until I get out of the program. So, what's a good way of me getting into the alt tab? Let's try alt tabbing into the thing again, then alt F4. Nope, it has crashed much worse than that. Because um, it's right now on the application screen. I've control deleted. And I can't select it. It just closes the window. So that doesn't help. I got the task manager up. I just don't know what to do with it. I can't show you that I have the task manager up. But just trust me. It says Skype's running. Uh, Twitch is, or, uh, Firefox is running. OBS is running. Fallout is not. Um, and, oh, it's delete, isn't it? There we go. That's what I've got to press. I always forget what I need to do. Ah. <sighs> I can't get to processes from, uh, if I don't have mouse control, you can't get to processes from there. Try and do it yourself. Open up, like, I don't know, some folder or something and get to the processes. And the game isn't even launching now. Good. Let me try and uh, in the process. It's probably still running in the background. It does this sometimes when you uh, break a game. What is it called? It's probably called either Fallout or New Vegas. Uh, a, B, C, D, F, G, H, 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 Q, R, S, T, V. Okay, I don't see it on the list. Dropbox is on the list. We can go ahead and... Uh, You can tab to select processes. Now that just allowed me to go through the different buttons. There we go. Now the game's running. Just needed a second to fully close out, I guess. I don't want to access the Steam community while playing. Fuck off.
All right, we're probably gonna have to bring what's his shit back to life. Um. Control tab allows you to switch between different modes. Okay, good. All right, so let's not try and kill her. Uh, help the boomers around Nellis. Let's try and help someone else, because you're fucking useless. Is this going to be a um, fucking museum kid again? Okay. Can we, um, hold on. I should probably bring most of the, the body of Pete outside the, uh, was it Z to pick up things? Okay, come here, Pete. Fuck. Fuck. I shouldn't just kill people. I think to myself, knowing that full well that I'm going to again. Um. Come on. Alright, fine. Uh, is it resurrect? Res? Am I spelling that right? I'm pretty sure I'm not. Um, live. Res. Stop dead. Resurrect. There we go. Hey! Welcome back! Were you interested in hearing the story of our- Absolutely fucking not, but go ahead and tell me anyway. Wonderful. I'm sure you've noticed the mirror on the wall of this hut. I Shall haven't. I tell you what it all means? Oh! For sure! Excellent. Imagine you're the first outsider to ever hear our tale. <clears throat> I just don't fucking care. Like, realistic- ago, long before I was born, we lived underground. Everyone had guns. <sighs> but the overseer wouldn't let us explode anything. Not even a hand grenade. We left and wandered the wastes. They were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades. <sighs> burned them with flamethrowers. It was neat, but there was a downside. For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost one of our own. We needed a new home. We needed Nellis. Here we have prospered and multiplied. Here All right. mighty guns destroy any savages who might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Your story sucks, well, kid. Ah. But not saying you want to harm us or you're a savage, but anyways. Nellis has revealed many secrets. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once based here, and it has taught us where to find one. It's fine. And that is our story so far. For this last image is our future. To restore the bomber, to fly the open skies in armored safety, raining high explosive ordnance upon ignorant savages. This is our destiny. Uh -huh. I'm pleased that you listened to the entire story. Well, Perhaps I didn't have a fucking choice. Know more about. Let me know. No, I don't fucking care, kid. Now that you know the story of our. Yeah, uh, the fucking bur- the vertebird thing. Um, I have some questions about your history. Um... Once we restore power, we learn that some elaborate chairs we've been sleeping in were actually virtual- We believe they were used to train combat pilots. We use them extensively. I alone have shot down over 500 Chinese- no, you have. You, you played I'm video there's games. There's no way you can be allowed to use the simulators. Therefore, our yeah, because they didn't feel like coding. That's beautiful. Yes, it's exactly like that. So free. So yeah. anything else? Yeah, I'd like to fucking fly the thing. You're right. They weren't here when we discovered Nellis. We found the guns at a huge weapon depot called Area 2, many miles from here. It took many weeks to drag the guns and their ammunition back to Nellis, and it was a. Thank 
thank you so much. I'll be sure to pet anything else you want to know. No, I'm telling you everything. That's enough history for now. History was never a subject I cared about. And I don't care about fucking fake history with this piece of shit. You know what? You like fucking explosives, kid? You fucking like explosives? We got explosives. Enjoy, bitch. All right, where's Pearl? I'm done with this shit. Look, Veronica, I understand where you're coming from, but Jesus fucking Christ, I could not care less. Where's Pearl at? Pearl, you in here? Hey, you got a second? Uh, yeah, what is it? The Brotherhood is failing. I've always known that. If we don't change course, we're going to fall apart or uh -huh. fade away. But until recently, I haven't understood where we went wrong or how to fix it. I think I need to go home. Um. Great. Thanks. Thank you. I'll encourage people to name their non-ugly children after you. Seriously. All right. We'll go there straight after killing Pearl. Hey, Pearl. I don't know how you survived the bombardment. That's incredible. <laughs> Fuck, I missed. Where are you at? Yep, Pearl has died. Done. Alright, let's peace out. We're gone. I don't fucking care. That's what you get for fucking making me learn history. That history sucks. Literally, no one fucking cares. Oh shit! Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Ah, shit. Shit! Veronica! Veronica! They're shooting at us! Veronica! Shit, I'm out of ammo on this gun. Good job, Veronica! Merciful thug. I'm occasionally known to show my charitable side. Yep. Mini boomer. Shit, fuck! Why does everything explode here? Child, get back here! Child! Done! No future for you fuckers! I'm tired of your bullshit! Get the fuck away from me with this! Veronica, we're peacing out! I'm on fire! I'm dead! Yep, I know. I remember. Okay, we're done here. Yeah. Alright, let's go do this thing. We're 
go to Repcon. <sighs> All right, fine. All right, where are we going, Veronica? What the fuck are we doing again, Mr. Gutsies? How may I serve you, Master? No, chill the fuck out. Lagging a bit there. I'm slightly fucking miffed. There's a whole lot of something coming this way. Oh, fucking. S ah, shit, fuck. God damn it. God damn it. Piece of shit. No, oh, fuck, that lander right next to us. Run, Veronica, run. I killed Caesar. You can fuck off now. You right there, Veronica? All right, fine. Fucking grenade then. All right. All right. Get out of here with that bullshit. Did you just throw dynamite at me? Oh shit. Where did that come from? I'm not gonna use the cheater. Oh, Veronica's down. Rocket, run! Shit, fuck. Okay, stats, doctor bag, does that heal me completely? No, it just heals my limbs, it's good enough. Dude, Veronica, I don't think we can do this. Veronica, watch out! Not gonna work. I need to level the fuck up. What is my gun skill at? 50? Really? I'm halfway up that and I still can't hit the fucking thing? Okay, grenade the rifle then. Um. Oh, shit.
Okay. Hunting revolver, grenade rifle. There we go. I also need to, um... Do I have any mines? Dynamite, frag mine. No frag mine, frag grenades. Grenade, launcher. Grenade, launcher. Grenade, rifle. Did I just drop it? Shit. Where the fuck is my gun? Did I... Fuck is my gun? Shit, Veronica, help me find my gun. Shit. I don't care if I hate me now. They clearly already do. Ah. Alright, let's try and use the grenade this time. Grenade rifle. I don't know where I dropped it, but... Uh-oh. Yeah, uh-oh is right! Finish them off, Veronica! Mr. Hands! Let me get some health going. Any, um... I guess I'm gonna have to go to stats to find it. I'm level 13. How do you have armor to deal with a fucking grenade blast? What? That took forever to blow up. Did I get him? Hey, I leveled! Alright, well. Oh, God. Alright, so we're putting some points into gun. Putting, like, ten points into that. Um... See what else can we get? Um, that seems good. All right, hey, and I got a uh, a new ability. Can get tin head. Um, additional melee damage against things that you don't want to go into melee with. Um, oh, that's a different thing. Man machine. These are. Um, Okay, that seems pretty good. Robotics expert, life giver. I don't think that's any good. Um, okay. Here and now is pretty awful if I remember correctly. Um, terrifying presence. Um, let's 
strong back seems useless. Uh, sneering imperialist. It might be worth getting, like, fight the power. What do you think I should get? Because I don't fucking know. Gunslinger. Run and gun. Comprehensive. Cannibal. Adamantium skeleton seems pretty good. Get commando. A couple of people said commando. Shotgun sh surgeon. I don't think is an option. Um, it is. Um, I don't use shotguns all that much. All right. Um, commando. What is commando? While using a rifle. Your accuracy in bats and bolt time is significantly increased. That seems pretty good, actually. Um, adamantium skeleton is probably pretty good, too. So let's put it between, uh, and what is nerd rage? Someone said nerd rage. Um, whenever my health is low, I get more damage reduction. So adamantium skeleton or um, commando. Those are the choices. I'm going to go with whatever chat says first. Both seem like they'd be pretty good. Um, adamantium skeleton. Okay. 50% less damage sounds pretty good. We'll get commando next time. I think I've said several what times. Did What'd you miss? Dude. Like. Fucking. Lots. Actually. Dumb looking helmets. Um, ammo. Okay. What is this? Thermalic Lance. Considering how often I get crippled in this game, it's probably worth it to take the thing that makes it so it's. Harder for me to get crippled. Um, we'll take the dinars because they weigh like nothing and are worth a lot. Um, okay. Um, the fuck were we doing? The lance is great. It seems like it's going to be heavy and not that usable. Let's look at it. Lance. It's under T for thermalic. Thermic. Alright, I guess we'll try it on the next thing we see. Have I seen the gun rudders yet? Yes. Actually, I was really low level when I got to New Vegas, so. Um. All the mods for this game are ultra serious. It's kind of boring. Um, this game's all right. It's um, it's definitely not going to be one of my favorite games of all time because it has such unenjoyable characters and uh, stuff like that. But You have to hold down when you use it, okay. I don't understand it. Do I, like... Hit people with it? I should get cannibal? I probably should. Something down there. Oh, fuck, the day. Death claws? Shit, death claws. We're dead. We're dead. Oh god, they're big. Um, come on, Veronica. We need to go. I'm still not at a level where I think I can handle death claws. Fancy giant vibrator, got it. 
No, Veronica. Veronica, not the time or the place. Shit, Veronica's just dead. Why the tits am I here at level 13? Well, 14 now. Because I fucking have shit to do. I wanted to beat this game, we're gonna goddamn beat this game. I understand that Veronica is unconscious, but that's her own fault for not following me. Neil Shack, is this where we're going, Veronica? Because it seems like that's where it's pointing me. Also, are they still following me? Also, is Veronica still following me? Is she back? This is a dangerous place, human, especially for your kind. What the fuck? I suggest you turn back. There's nothing good waiting for you further on. Um. You must have heard a radio broadcast. I actually the why don't. a human would follow her invitation here is beyond me, unless you didn't listen very closely. I don't actually listen the to the radio. The radio belongs to Tabitha, the supreme commander of Black Mountain. Or as she calls it, the state of Utopatha. She uh -huh. took control of this place almost two years ago. The super mutants here do whatever she says, and she says humans are to be killed on sight. Um. Help would improve the odds. Help might just make the difference. All right, if you're good enough at what you do to meet me in the village up near the peak, we can talk further. Okay. I'll have a plan by the time I see you, if I see you. Good luck. It's gonna be a lot harder for you to get up there than it will be for me. Cause you can just teleport. Goodbye. Still going where Veronica wants. Hearing all sorts of sounds that make it sound like there's something horrible chasing me. But, um. Yeah. What the fuck is that thing? Is it Death Claws? Yeah, fuck that, man. No. He can go and try and do his own rebellion. Fuck you. I'm working on my own. Hey, what's trying to kill me? That's the constant game we're playing here while we play this game. What the fuck's trying to kill me and why? It's a rad scorpion. And I'm not going to be able to hit shit from here. So, I guess we just fall straight down this cliff face. And we're fine. Hey, Veronica! Hold on. Gotta, um, heal up a bit. Alright. Oops. I like how I resurrected Pete just to hear a story that I immediately decided I didn't give a fuck about. I think I hit it a couple of times. Please save before I do these things. Saving? Eh? What's shooting? Hey, Veronica, something's shooting at us, and I don't think it's these bark skeletons. Or scorpions, whatever. The fuck is shooting us? Oh, God. Okay, hold on. Um, explosives. Grenade rifle, there we go.
Oh, oh, whoa, on fire, on fire, on fire. Stop that, stop that. Sorry, Veronica. You all right? You all right, Veronica? You okay? You okay? Cause that didn't look good. Y you okay there, Veronica? Mm -hmm. There you go. You're just a good girl. You're get. You're you're going. All right. Um. Wow. Okay. That was fucking intense. Something sees us. Something new sees us. What is it? Okay. Veronica, where the fuck are we going? You have friends that live out here? Cause let me tell you right now, your friends fucking suck. This place fucking sucks. Look at this. Look at this. This is where you want me to go? What the fuck, Veronica? Yeah, exactly this way. Is this... Is this the right quest? Okay, I guess we go into this. Oh, we're so fucking dead. Are you guys chill? So I'm chill with you. I brought a friend. What? Okay. She's gonna go ahead and go on in. Hey, Veronica. Let us talk about. Hope you're picking the winning side here. Be nice to fight for someone who's gonna be around for a while. He was what? You ever hear about a guy called Benny? I killed him. Silliest dress band of raping, slaving marauders you'll see east of California. I'll say that. Where's that touch of old work? Although, I hear the soldiers mount each other as much as they mount their women, so maybe they did keep a little something from the Empire. Okay. No such privilege for the women, though. Figures. So... To answer your question... Uh-huh. Okay, good. That's... See, hypocritical jerkwads, not how I would have described them. I would have described them as assholes. But, um... You know, whatever. I mean, we're on the same page. We don't like them. So, you know. Hey. Anyone home? Hold on. I've got this. Okay. I'd like a large atomic shake and a double Brahmin burger. And easy on the agave sauce this time. We gave you a password, Veronica. It's for your safety. I know where you live, Ramos. Open up. <sighs> for Pete's sake, opening up. Welcome back, Veronica. Hey. Caesar had a brain tumor? Well, he's dead, so... Listen up. I'm in charge of security around here, uh -huh. and I can't say I'm too happy about having an outsider waltzing around. But since you came in with Veronica, I'm inclined to cut you a little slack. Just behave. Okay. Oh, and the elder's going to want to talk to you. Well, of course, He's there's the some fucking level. elder that wants to just talk to you. Just take a right. That's how this game down. works. My office is right here in case you need anything. Just ask for Ramos. Okay. More importantly, where the fuck is? All right, um... Oh, wow, this looks like all sorts of things that I don't want to try and fuck with him. I know he's got a Gauss rifle, but are you the Elder? 
I'm really busy now. Sorry. Okay. Elder. Looking for the Elder. Mr. House is out. Uh huh. Yeah, I killed House. Where's the Elder? Then you bring your second unit up to provide covering fire, like so. Literally, no one's here learning from you. Only a few people get to venture outside, usually to trade for food. I'm not gonna kill the elder because Veronica likes these people. We'll just get the yes man bots to do it. Elder? Elder. If I can get a shit ton of awesome stuff from these guys, I'm down with this. Veronica, you know this fucking place, right? Oh god, you're getting stuck on these things. Probably not. Alright, um. Bro. Hey. Looks like Mr. Ha- Ah, uh, more VR training. Maybe I'll hit the shooting range instead. Elder. Looking for an elder. There's a map. I forget that there's a map in this game. I know I could murder people, but come on. Like, you know, we, we're civilized. We wait until they give us a reason, and so far, the only brother, Brotherhood of Steel person I know is Veronica, and she's fucking cool. So right now, me and the Brotherhood of Steel, we're fucking tight. I'm fine with them. Hey. Hey. How may Hello, you must be the outsider everyone's talking about. Yeah. I'm Linda Schuller. Uh-huh. If you ever need medical attention, this is the... I think I'm hurt. This? Uh-huh. This might... Okay, thanks. Still breaking hearts there, I see, scribe Schuler. You gonna have a conversation with her? Hello. Can I help? Yeah, um... I'd like you to perform cybernetic surgery. Sure. If you... What? The fuck? What? What? Uh, increases my barter and speech skills. Okay. I can't, so never mind. Well then. Can I steal from the hospital? I need to steal from the hospital. Okay. Our instruments show some impressive power fluctuation. Uh -huh. Hello. Can I help you with something? I would like to um you're a doctor. Yes, I handle all medical needs in the bunker. If you're ever wounded, I can treat you. Uh -huh. Normally I'd just be the base's medical officer. But my other duty uh, what are your other duties? I'm this bunker's head scribe in everything but name. I supervise the research teams. I Senior collate scribe. the reports. I attend the meetings. But for reasons beyond me, that buffoon Taggart still gets the title. And don't get me started on that little pet of his. Everyone around here knows what's going on there but her. Um, why not tell him? Oh, I tried. The Elder listened patiently to my carefully constructed argument regarding why the buffoon should lose his position. Then he just as patiently explained to me that Taggart's work was vital to our cause, and that he wasn't to be trifled with lesser matters. What is your accent? But vital to our cause? Hardly. Okay. Um, bye. Alright, um... Fucking... What am I doing? Go to this person, I guess. Is it just gonna lead me back to senior scribe? What's her face? Cause I don't care. Yeah, it's almost like an organization called the Brotherhood of Steel might be a little bit sexist. That's a good point. Um, I never would have thought that an organization called the Brotherhood of something or other would be biased towards men. Hey. Elder. Can we come closer? Elder! Fuckface! Hello, Veronica. Oh. How goes your mission? We'll know in a second. I wanted to talk to you. Veronica, tell me this isn't about... Yes, goddammit, it is. Okay, can you, you take off the mask? This time. We've been through this. The things I've seen now, 
other groups succeeding where we fail, it's not too late for us. We've outlasted the end of the world. We'll outlast these upstarts. Waiting in a hole for everyone else to die. If we must. This is a dead end for us. I see no evidence of that. Nor do I see anyone out there with a solution to our problems. How could you? You're too scared to look. Let's go. We're wasting our time. Okay. What happened just now? Wasn't paying attention. Okay, bye. What is this? This looks like a fucking map. So there's the rocket where the ghouls were. Then there's that, and that's NCR. There's the boomers, and I don't know what that is. The cons aren't on this map. You guys know about the cons? Alright, we're peacing out. Can I get some power armor? I'd slap him around, but he stood at my parents' wedding. Oh. Plus, he used to make excuses to get me out of my punishment when I'd slept through head scribe Taggart's lectures. Figure I owe him for that. Okay. <sighs> he means well. Um. No, but it does make it easier to forgive him. He's. It's not too late to. Uh. He's a stubborn old man, but when it comes down to it. Okay. If he sees some indisputable sign we're on the wrong course, he won't ignore it. Okay, so what are you trying to accomplish? That's my question to the Elder. All these years, the Brotherhood has collected weapons technology. To keep it out of people's hands? That clearly hasn't worked. To defend ourselves? We can't compete with the NCR's numbers or the Legion's. We're fighting a war for a lost cause. If we're going to survive, we have to find a role in society. Attract new members. Uh-huh. Look at the followers of the Apocalypse. They use their expertise to improve people's lives. They train them to be self-sufficient. That expertise cultivates respect and gratitude. Yeah, I just think they're scrubs. their ideals. Draws talent to their cause. They make friends like we make... But they don't know a fraction of what we know. If we took on their role, we could stand up to anyone. I don't know. I don't know. We... The only thing that gets his attention... Huh. Our elder before McNamara... Right, right, right. He had a nose for recovering lost technology. He'd send scribes out into the desert chasing whatever leads he you found. You have to do their quest line to wear the armor? Okay. trusted me with. I can think of at least one that proved my point, if it still exists. There's a comm terminal not too far from here. I'd use to access messages from him. If we go there, I can pull up his research on it. Okay, let's head out. I'm with you. Being around here isn't the same anymore. Okay. Actually, let me go talk to this dude. Let me see if I can convince him of anything. When Paladin Ramos informed me that Veronica was approaching with an outsider in tow, at f uh -huh. after giving the matter some thought, however, I've just... However, I will not force you to help us. Should you refuse, you will be allowed to leave here. Though you'd remain... Uh -huh. What do you say? Um... Then allow me to explain our situation. This bunker is... In exceptional cases, teams are sent out to investigate sites or retrieve materials deep. Uh -huh. Three such teams have gone missing recently. And the, uh -huh. in order to maintain the peace and adhere to the strictures of the lockdown, I need to send someone else to discover what happened to them. Okay. I'll look into it. I'm glad I can count on you. Oh, and one other thing. Uh -huh. The shielding of the bunker prevents us from actively tracking them. But their positions should show up on you. Okay. Should our worst fears become realized, please bring back all three of the holotapes from the patrols. I've given the order that you be given access to some of the equipment our scouts and patrols have scouted. You won't be allowed to purchase any prohibited equipment, but hopefully... Okay. So, oh. You're the outsider that's been given leave to wander around freely. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I guess. Name's Harden. I'm the head paladin of this chapter. Nice comb over. I think we might be able to help each other out. I don't know what the Elder talked to you about, but I can tell you this chapter is in trouble. And he's at the center of it. Are you willing to listen to what I have to say? Oh, God, your voice is just irritating me. Um... Sure. As you may have already heard, this entire base is under a state of lockdown. Uh -huh. No one goes out except small patrols at night. Most of the chapter has been sealed in here for years. Yeah. And those few who are outside when the lockdown was initiated are forbidden from returning. Uh -huh. Morale has plummeted as time has gone by. Yeah. And many of our current paladins haven't seen combat outside of training simulations. 
and all because of the elder's explicit order that no one be allowed in or out. But I just came in. The like only it was way nothing. things will change is if a new elder is installed. Okay. Um. Uh, well, I don't want a part of I this. I have expected you to say that. Should you continue dealing with the elder and find yourself beginning to see my point of view? Okay. If I ever want to usurp, whatever. Everyone just wants me to fucking usurp you other people. Been practicing your drills, Veronica. It's dangerous outside. What is this? Veronica brings an outsider into our home. Then yeah. the two of you may have the elder fooled. Veronica has always twisted the founder's principles to her own ends. We will not stand idly by. Uh huh. Are you? Did I just get arrested? Sorry no. about that. Just because I love them doesn't mean some of them aren't assholes. Yeah, that's family. Um, let's see. Where am I going? Uh, still in the dark, you say? I have to do still in the dark in order to get the armor? Is that what I need to do? I have played System Shock 2 before, yeah. That was a long time ago, though. Still in the dark. Okay. So, this guy. This quest is the one I need to do. Our instruments show some impressive power fluctuations coming from across the river. Don't care. Okay, world map. I know I haven't. Well, this quest is closer, so we'll go do it and then we'll stop. I was able to get System Shock to work um, a while ago, but all right, um, this one's closest, so we'll go to it first. Will I be streaming Fallout 4? I, this game's starting to warm up to me, but only because of a shit ton of mods like Killable Children and Helpless Falling, which is always hilarious and does not stop being funny. Ah, oh, feels so good. We have a virus link. Yep. Banu. Thank you. Yeah, if you see someone post like something like that, let me know and I can uh can give it a quick ban. I don't know why people do that. It seems so weird that people like purposely try and give other people bit like uh fucking words viruses we'll do this one then we'll go to the next thing is it just really dark or what's going on what's here oh arm centaurs oh good nope nope You know, Veronica, could you really use some fucking help here? I need a better gun. Uh, let's see, grenade rifles, probably gonna work. Maria. 
sawed off shotgun, don't have any shotgun ammo. Um, that gun, got some 5.56 ammo, but. Single shotgun, that'll work. Not a particularly good gun, but at least I have a gun out now. Ooh, okay. Centaur blood and centaur tongue. Okay. I don't know what centaur blood is for, so. Over here. What are those? For the love of God, what are those? Yeah, we're not doing that today. We're just not. We ain't doing that. Use the lance. Uh, maybe. Okay. Uh-huh. They have lots of health, whatever they are. And it's fighting whatever the fuck that is. So we've got two things that are horrifying. Both vying for my attention to be the most horrifying thing I've ever seen in my life. I don't know which one's going to win. Um, Jesus Christ. Their blood is 15 cat vendor trash. Does it weigh anything? It does not, so. Monster mods, yes. Veronica, please don't try and punch those. Like, let's think about this for a minute. I don't think the floater is much of a hassle, but... Mo? What is Mo? Want a mango? What? What the fuck is that? Well, it's dead now. Okay. Well, I found the Brotherhoods of Steel. Hey, power armor. Laser rifle, not all that good. When does Vinny start streaming? I don't think he's got a schedule, so there you go. Laser. All right, let's go ahead and get out of the fucking hole. Where are you at, uh, Veronica? Veronica? I hear you fisting. You gotta be fisting whatever this th Oh, okay. That thing's dead now. Veronica. For fuck's sake, Veronica, get over here. Veronica. Does jumping at them with my fist? Yes! Finally! You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't no, you? No, I, I am, but trust me, it's gonna be worth it, because you can have this power armor, which you can wear, right? You know how to wear that? Yeah, there you go. Now you look horrifying. Yeah, he know he lets you guys know before he goes live. Okay, there's nothing in the Wanna Mango. Okay. How far are the other two? Also, my radiation levels are a little bit high. Um, okay. Um, mission statement. Um, Paladins Hughes to uh, blah, blah, blah. Mutants have been reasonable. Okay. So, mutants. Mutant problems. Do they have helmets? It doesn't look like it. Uh, world map. You can always watch Vinny's stuff on his full sauce channel. He search like Vine Sauce Full Sauce. I think most of the streamers, I know me, Vinny, and Yol do at least, have like full stream channels if you want to like watch anything after it's done. All right. Um. Okay. Fiend corpses. 
Oh, dude, I want that helmet. Oh, that helmet is fucking cool as shit. I'm taking that. Um, helmet. Yes! Holy fucking shit, I look badass now. Veronica, Veronica, tell me I look badass. I fucking know, right? Hey, Mr. Hands. Hello. Please remember visiting hours are from 10 a.m. until 5 p.m. Please show your badge or make your way out of the building. Okay. This is where I need to be. Because I feel like it's probably not. Um, uh, no, actually I do need to be here. Are these guys gonna get pissy with me if I, uh, start walking? Fuck off! Of course, of course. Don't let me keep you. Yeah. Museum of robots and shit. Whoops. Okay, Veronica, fucking watch me. They will attack. Okay. I don't remember the last time me, Vinny, and you all streamed together. It's been a while. Where am I going? Where the fuck am I going? Why are there whale sounds? Where's the fucking whale? Holy shit, whales. Hey, how's it going? Uh, sucking my dick, that's how you can serve me. Go ahead and take all of it into your mouth. Uh, take it that he's gonna get kind of pissy with me if I try and uh, open this. Explanation. Okay. Exciting. Okay. Morning. Okay, it has ing on the end. Uh, probably starts with an M. Blinking. There we go. Terminal locked, please what? Oh. Oh. Please go away. You have been warned. Please Um Okay. Um, doors open. Oh, I could have, uh, bypassed the lock. Because I just figured I'd blow him up. Oh, wow. Lag as I enter this room. What is going on here that is... So lag inducing! Jesus Christ and a fucking ant shake! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Oh, that's not me dropping frames! That is just how it looks! It is like 5 FPS through here! Jesus Christ! Oh, that's ugly! What is happening? Okay. Unauthorized facial pattern. Please present credentials for first floor access. Oh, Jesus. Please do not make your way to the second floor. What in God's name is causing this much lag? Oh. Ugh. 
Make it stop! Oh god. Oh god. Oh, there's screen tearing all over the place. It's my computer tries to understand what the fuck's happening to it. Why I hate it so much. Oh. God. Please let me go. Unauthorized facial pattern. Um. What? Is this hex? What is this in hexadecimal? Does someone know this? Okay. Looks like a memory leak. Okay. Maybe I should load from downstairs. I'm just gonna load. Nope, it's just shit now. I don't know why. Um. Alright, well why don't we stop there, because we seem to be having some problems. Um. No, Nightbot is chill. Nightbot is a, um... Nightbot is my bot. Um, I set him up. Uh, I think that's where I'm gonna... I'm gonna stop it anyway. It's been two hours. I need to, to stop. Let me check for art real quick. I am dropping frames really fucking hard right now, though, so... Enjoy that while I, uh, look for art. And this music. You can also enjoy it. Okay. Looks like the frame dropping has stopped, which is convenient. You guys were just looking at a blank screen for the most part anyway. Um, this one I believe is Sticky Hunter. Nope, it's Meta Mendu. I don't know how. Okay. I don't know how to pronounce this person's name, so you guys are going to have to excuse me if I don't get it pronounced right. Um, let's, there we go. Alright, this one is done by someone whose name I cannot pronounce, but it's something like Metamandu. Metamandu. Um, Meta... Mandy. Metamandy. Can you see that? Where it says that? Metamandu. This fucking sh shit, hold on, that scene. Zoom in, enhance, zoom in. This person, M Meta, Meta Mandy. Meta Mandy. Anyway, they did this. Uh, it's a reference to Trulip. Uh, everyone seems to be loving the Trulip thing. Uh, We need to do more of that, me and Tilda, but we haven't had a chance yet to do it, so. Anyway, uh, we'll do that. We'll do that whenever she has off and I have energy. Uh, this one is done by Ethan5. Um, a little bit of a MS Paint action going on. Make sure you uh, use the paint bucket tool inside the letters as well. Uh, the Iron but Brothers. There's, I believe there's an H in Brother. Um, the Iron Brothers. Do they hate Veronica because she's in the Iron Brothers? It's apparently something I said. Alright. Um. Alright. Well, I think that's where I'm gonna end it, then. Um, I'll definitely put up the, uh, 
all hosts, Limes, or whoever's streaming. Um, and I'm going to peace out now. So I'll see you guys later. Bye!